What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we got a litter tool here and we got the Traxxas horse here. So um, we had an issue. This guy was about to do a good pass and the control arm broke and then the tire blew right there. So we're going to put new tires in this baby. So we got the same tires. Jayco's. Um, there's some part number here if you guys are gonna need it. Um, part number here is uh, there's no part number here. Okay, part number is in the back. Jayco J A C two zero five zero L P. Okay, these are soft wheels. Uh, couldn't find nothing else, but we're gonna put these baby on. So um, these two came off my rustler, the one that's already on this truck. So the rustler is out of commission, but we will repair that wheel. Um, it's only needs a gluing and, and the rustler, the nitro rustler, is not that fast. So same part, two sets, same part number for both of these. And we're going to put these babies on. What we're going to do here is, um, I'm going to simply just take off the tires. Um, well, I got, I got the other part of the wheel right there. So as you see, this is chunked off. So we'll manage to get that baby on. So very simple and easy. Let's put these away. And... Going through this kind of stuff is part of the game. A lot of people complain and uh, bitch and moan, and they think that they sh they're good in the hobby, but they shouldn't have to spend money. So if you're getting into the hobby, you're thinking about getting into the hobby, you are going to be spending money. Don't think that you're not going to be spending money. Little, little stuff like this. These are like 30 bucks uh, for the set. Probably less than that, I think. And uh, I got a new control arm coming in, so I'll do a video on that. We'll just leave that wheel off. So this baby, look at those. Those look real nice and shiny. The first one, they was off the nitro, so they were kind of filthy because the nitrogen gas and all the oil coming out of it. So look at the difference here. <laughs> look at the back and look at the front tire here. Look at the difference in color. Okay, so fresh videos coming out with this baby down the road. We're trying to get this baby to go to 100. It can go 100. I could go all out or just can't take steps. I like to have fun, enjoy, and then uh, go litter by litter. That's what I've been planning on doing. Okay, there it goes. When stuff falls off my table, I never find it. So I always look down, where did it go? So if something falls, I keep an eye on that baby. Because sometimes it goes. One time I was looking for something that fell, like a little pin, and could not find it. Spent hours and hours looking around because it's very important. I was gonna drive about 30 minutes to go buy it and ended up when I got home it was stuck between my shoelaces because it never fell on the ground it just went straight in my shoe anyways um, so we're gonna leave the front tire off because we got a control arm coming in and the reason why this tire blew it, it didn't blow because uh, it was a uh, high speed it blew because the the control arm uh, when I was doing my testing and tuning I forgot to, um, small little mistakes you're always going to make. I forgot to con connect my range booster. So I sent the car to see if it runs straight. It was running straight. But as soon as it got to the other end, uh, it's kind of going past fast. Probably like 40, 50 mile per hour testing this baby. And uh, it just lost range and it went straight into the wall. The control arm came out of the pin. Didn't like snap in half. It just came out of the pin. And what I did was I put it back because it had the oval piece where the pin goes through. It just slipped right through. So I closed it back and I put the pin in. It did about, um, it went 70 mile per hour, but that arm, it went airborne. The vibration just made that the pin and the arm come loose. And then the wheel must have hit somewhere on the body. And because once it tilted back, boom. It just broke. This is this is very bad, brutal break. Cause it, it wasn't like, look at that. Look at how this shattered. Look how this baby shattered. Okay, so this came off. So we'll glue this right back so my rustler can still limp back and forth. Shouldn't be an issue. And then we'll put this on the tire drawer and we'll make it even. Cause all I need to do is glue this baby just like that. And we'll do a video on that so Sometimes you got to be cheap. So I'm going to leave this wheel off because we got to replace that control arm. It's coming. And thank you for watching this video, guys. Um, so this is what this baby looks like now. And it's going to have our fourth wheel right here. And simple little stuff. Um, now I got spare wheels and fresh wheels. And no need to chew these down. 
Anyways, thank you for watching my video. Tractor's horse. I don't know if I, I don't know if I said a rustler. Okay, I was talking about the other rustler. So the horse is back in business. Just need a controller. Thank you for watching my video. See you guys on the next video. Don't forget to subscribe, share, and like. Stay tuned for more videos.